Hi guys, we are starting a new IBM series. This series will discuss on IBM Drone Survey SOP, rules for carrying out drone survey, and data output and formats. In this video, we will discuss on IBM Drone Survey SOP. So let me give you a small introduction on mines and why the governing bodies such as IBM have been formed. Mining is the extraction of valuable minerals and other geological materials from the earth. The profitable substances that are mined from the earth are called minerals. The minerals are valuable in their pure form, but in earth they are mixed with unwanted rocks and minerals. The mix of mineral and rock is usually carried away from the mine and processed later and refined to isolate the mineral. Since the mining industry is a major economic activity, poaching and other illegal activities are common. To monitor these activities, governing bodies such as IBM have been developed. The Indian Bureau of Mines, established in 1948, is a multidisciplinary government organization under the Department of Mines. It is headquartered at Nagpur, Maharashtra. It is engaged in promotion of conservation, scientific development of mineral resources, and protection of environment in mines other than coal, atomic minerals, petroleum and natural gas, and minor minerals. The primary mission of Indian Bureau of Mines is to promote systematic and scientific development of mineral resources of the country both onshore and offshore through regulatory inspections of the mines, approval of mining plans and environment management plans to ensure minimal adverse impact on environment. Ministry of Mines has incorporated Rule 34A in the MCDR, which means Mineral Conservation and Development Rules 2017 for Submission of Digital Aerial Images of Mining Lease Areas to Indian Bureau of Mines. The MCDR have been framed under Section 18 of the Mines and Minerals Development and Regulation Act 1957 or the MMDR Act to provide rules regarding conservation of minerals, systematic and scientific mining, development of the mineral in the country and for the protection of environment. The provisions of Rule 34A of MCD are as follows. So basically, a lessee is a person who holds the lease of a property and he needs to carry out excavation to get the minerals. So the rule states that every lessee having an annual excavation plan of 10 lakh ton or more in a particular year needs to survey using the drone. Also, any lessee having leased area of 50 hectare or more should also carry out the drone survey. They need to survey not only the lease boundary but also up to 100 meters outside the lease boundary in the month of April or May every year and submit the outputs or any other format as specified by IBM on or before July 1st every year. This is the least area boundary of a site and this is the extended lease boundary. Here you can see that this is having 100 meter distance. The survey should be conducted up to this boundary. If you are confused on how to increase the lease boundary, I will show you how to make one. Open this free tool, click on the KML boundary extension and upload your original KML of the leased boundary. This is the original KML file. At the top right corner, input the distance in meter up to which you need to extend your original boundary. Here I give 100 meter and then click submit. 
the green boundary is your extended boundary you can check the area extended with the help of this button place the bubbles on one end of the original boundary and the other at the extended boundary now you can see that the value is the same that we had inputted that is 100 meter every lessee not mentioned in the first rule shall submit soft copy of high resolution geo referenced ortho rectified satellite images of the leased area which is outside the scope of this video the third provision of rule 34a of mcdr applies to lessee who wants to do any modification in the site every lessee who needs to submit any mining plan document or modification to IBM need to carry out a drone survey. Mining plan is a primary document for the grant of a mining lease. This document connects the mine with all the stakeholders. They also need to survey up to 100 meters outside the lease boundary within six months before submission and shall submit the result along with the application for approval or modification of mining plan to the concerned regional controller of mines and controller general IBM. The ones who have submitted under this rule should not submit under the previous rule. The fourth provision of rule 34A of MCDR is for the bidders issued with a letter of intent or LOI. A letter of intent is a document declaring the preliminary commitment of one party to do business with another. The letter outlines the chief terms of a prospective deal. So the bidders issued with the LOI for grant of a mining lease can carry out a drone survey of the mining block granted through auction. They also need to survey up to 100 meters outside the lease boundary and submit the outputs along with the mining plan to the regional controller and the controller general IBM. The last provision states that the SOP for carrying out the drone survey and form of the data to be submitted shall be specified by IBM from time to time. These are the provisions of rule 34A of MCDR. In the next video, we will see the rules for carrying out the drone survey. This brings us to the end of the video. If you are watching this video for the first time, please like and subscribe. And we will be sharing more videos weekly. Click on the bell icon so that you won't miss any of the upcoming videos. And thank you for watching the video.